and whimsy. And we're getting blown away. <laughs> Not by prices, but by the wind. <laughs> we're on the New Haven shore at Jordan's Furniture. And it has the It as well in it, which is the world's largest rope course. That's right, the world's largest indoor, rope course. Indoor oh, rope course. Indoor rope course, okay. So we're gonna do some furniture dreaming and we're gonna wander in and see some of the fun stuff and we're gonna look at maybe some things for our uh, adventurer study. And meanwhile, let's see what Jordan's has in, in, in surprise for us today. So we're going to try something new here because Jordan's sound was obnoxiously loud and we're going to try to voice this. These look like flowers we could actually keep alive though. Nah. We're going to look through for our bed. Oh, also the soundtrack to 10th Kingdom was playing right now. Jess once again gets all the working uh, doors. I really like this for our enchanted forest theme for our bedroom. I enjoy the leather and that it's a unique headboard design and also the underbed storage and the hardware on the dresser here. That's pretty cool. Yeah, actually look over here, Jess. They've got a they've got a leather bench on the other side and it's actually leather and not fake. They also have that in a darker color, but I think the lighter one is nice with this and with our sage in the the bedroom it'll look delightful. And look, the luggage in the background. Ooh, cool. I didn't and even see that. other decorative luggage in the background. Wow. Now this one, we also like the type of wood on it, and I enjoyed particularly once, you know, there you go, that it's a canopy bed, and we could wrap vines and foliage around it for our, our theme. You know what else we could do? We could tie a rope to it and use this bench as a launch point, and I could swing into bed just like Tarzan. I mean, that'd be pretty cool for our theme. You could. I think we need that as a stepping stool anyway. This was a very tall bed. <laughs> hey, you see that pillow, the blue one there? Yes. I know it's embroidered, but it kind of looks like binary code. It's pretty cool. True. Jess loves this. Tufted is her jam. So my jam. Now, these are very cool looking chairs. But as you can see from Dan's experience, they're very much looking chairs, not sitting chairs. These were not comfortable in any way at all. I don't know, I think he's exaggerating. Ooh, intimidation bed. So imposing. Now that is a sleigh bed. I want to roll around in a bag of toys. I want to hook a herd of reindeer up and pull it around town. I want to get cookie crumbs all over it. Well, the French version of the intimidation bedroom set the opulent sit. See. This is the little brother of the Br the sofa set we saw at the Brimfield market. Oh my god. You know this isn't Stardew Valley, right, Jess? You can't harvest your crops with this. Oh, I can. I'm so going to go harvest them right now. Ooh, steampunk bar. That is very unusual to see around here. You know what's better and more unusual? No idea. A biker bar. Oh my god, biker bar. Wordplay. Bad pun. Now the bench is kind of nice. I don't like the little uh, tables at the end though. Those look like big asterisks or Walmart signals. I agree, but I do still like the look of the driftwood bench though. I don't think I want to sit on it. Oh yeah. Now I think someone did not get the memo on how pool is played. There's definitely something wrong. Yeah, they're doing it wrong. Shuffleboard. Ooh, wait. This isn't a cruise ship. What's going on here? Now, this is huge. And what I don't get is, where do you put this in your house? Who has room for this? Is this for people who like Dotsons or don't like Dotsons? No matter what, it seems like it's really too low for anyone to actually sit on. Oh, just like a real Dotson. And we have reached the rope course end of things. It. Ooh. Okay, we're in a very cool area right now. Nice. We're going to look around here a little yeah. bit more after we go in and see this whole thing. Rigmarole. Looks like we got some dancing fountains going on here. And, and the 
and look up. A driving face and whoa. goodness it's my apothecary dream oh my goodness it's what I it's what I've always hoped and wished for <laughs> these are really amazing I like it I'm not normally an industrial person but this is fun even better from the front what? Dan has found a possible thing for his adventurer study Ooh. oh I think you're always supposed to be dwarfed when you have this person. Yes, yes. Sell all the shares. Sell it all. Weigh everyone off. Liquidate the assets. <laughs> Including the zirconium and the <laughs> californium. Ooh, dragon fire with gel. And trophies everywhere and prints. Alright, I guess, I guess he works. I mean... I feel like there would be way more purple in this room, but sure. All right, Jess, how much for one of the night pieces, the ceramic oh. night pieces? I'm gonna say 60. At Jordan's Furniture, obviously. I'm gonna say 65. I'm gonna say 85. Let's see. Oh. Well, that's unexpected. Are they plastic? Nope. <laughs> wow. That's not bad. Well done. I think we found a weird ASMR thing for Jess. It's not ASMR. It's just it's weird, big comforting jar. big jar. I big love jar. It. <laughs> big jar. <laughs> oh, ASMR jar. So this is something that would be kind of cool for our forest bedroom. Enchanted forest bedroom. I mean, I don't even mind having the clocks in there. It's very uh, <laughs> Alice in Wonderland. Very Alice in Wonderland oh, I like with that. The back clock, the one that's oh sticking out yeah. of the wall. That's kind of cool. But definitely these little sort of terracey things with uh, some vines and leaves on them. That was a crazy weekend. We've been very, very busy with two different trips to New Haven. Two very large furniture stores. <laughs> a lot of walking involved. We're not in the market to buy furniture right now. <laughs> no, but it was all for you. Yeah. <laughs> Good practice for Disney too, though, which is coming up. Yeah. Uh, so Jordan's was fun. Uh, each Jordan's has a different theme of something interesting, and we're going to stop at some of the other ones to show you guys what they have as well in the future. Very true. Um, the Reading one has a trapeze school and bean town. Um, and more of the fountains. Yep. And this one, clearly, you just saw what they had, which is pretty cool. We'll probably come back here at some point so that Dan can have his go at them. 
we are definitely coming back here because <laughs> I am going on that rope course. Today we were a little, uh, we had a little too much going on today for that, but uh, I am coming back probably with some friends and we're going to do that rope course. <laughs> so if you like what we're doing here, if you like us putting our bodies on the line for your enjoyment. If you want to see the weird furniture stores. <laughs> Why not subscribe? Get in on the mayhem and the madness. Give us a like, subscribe, see when we're doing more stuff. Tell Get us notified. in the comments what you want to see. Yeah, we're we're here to bring New England and the Northeast to you. <laughs> to you in particular. So we need to get going though, because yeah. it's time we Yeah, let's frost a let's cake. Let's frost a cake. <laughs>